What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Um, you know, I've said this before in past videos, the Miami Heat are getting into that category of like Dogecoin, Bitcoin, stocks that get out of control. People start chasing, think they're going to get rich quick. They jump in at the end and boom, it plummets. That's where we're at. That's where we're at with the heat. This is not up for debate. They are lucky to be in this spot. That's not up for debate. I'm done with this conversation. If Jason Tatum didn't turn his ankle on the first possession of that Celtics game, they were going to roll. They were going to hammer. Did you feel all the energy in that building? It fucking vanished as soon as he got hurt. The other players couldn't pick up the slack. Everyone was too shell-shocked by like, oh my God, Jason Tatum got hurt. I cannot believe this is happening right now. And they couldn't process it in time. Uh, they didn't have a coach that could make adjustments in real time, in fast speed, uh, a coach that doesn't command, discipline, a lot of things. So look, Nuggets, they have a good coach, right? This is a focus team. Everyone's saying they've had too much time off. They've had too much time off. They're going to be rusty. The Heat are coming in hot. They're going to get off to a good start, and they got a puncher's chance. Absolutely fucking not. Now, let me know in the comments if you disagree. I want to hear your comments below. And I am begging you guys to subscribe to the channel, put a like on this video, and come back to this video. Regardless if I'm right or maybe you in the comments are right, come back and say, ha ha, I told you so, or come back and know that I was right and make sure you're joining the channel here. Look, this is the biggest free money of the year so far. This playoff game is the biggest opportunity before the books are going to adjust everything accordingly. The Nuggets have discipline. They have a good coach. There's no more of this, eh, I don't know what team's going to show up. Brutal series, uh, physically and mentally for the Miami Heat. The Miami Heat got lucky with John, uh, Antetokounmpo getting hurt. The Bucks would have won. They got lucky with Jason Tatum getting hurt at the end. Celtics would have won. They are here on luck. They are in 8th seed. They are not good. Their roster is a bunch of nobodies. As long as the team they're playing has a little bit of mental capacity to play hard and realize, whoa, we're actually in the NBA Finals, something I always dreamed about as a kid. Maybe I should pour my sweat, blood, and tears into this game. As long as the Nuggets aren't like on drugs and half asleep like an IV in their arms, sedated, ready for surgery, they're going to wipe the floor with the heat. The heat are small. They got no size. The Joker's going to go off. You should take his player props before those get adjusted by the books. I'm going to give you my free play here in just a second, but I had to come in hot to this video, just like the Nuggets are going to come hot into this game. No, they're not going to be rusty. They have good players. They, they, they're, they're focused, they're locked in, they have been. They swept the Lakers. They went through the West. They beat Durant and Booker. And now they're going to lose to the Heat? Are you freaking kidding me? My free play in today's video is not to lay the, what, eight and a half points? Is it up to nine now? It's been bouncing back and forth here on FanDuel. I'm going to check it for you in real time. It's nine. Don't lay the nine. Take the alternative spread. Go to more wagers. Scroll over to margin. Where is margin? Denver Nuggets by 11 plus comes in at plus 115. It's a plus money wager. Plus 115. Nuggets by over 11 points. 11 or more. That is the play for today's video. This is a no brainer. This is truly free money. Think about it. Dogecoin, Bitcoin, these stocks, like a car deal. Everyone talks to you. You hear all this buzz going on. People start getting on the trend. They start hopping on the train. Everyone's excited. They really think it's legit. And then you're the one who goes into that late and you get wrecked. Absolutely not. These rosters are universes apart. The coaches are close Maybe Spolster is that much better just from experience. I actually like the other coach better. Uh, I'm having a, 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 a blank here, a mind blank on his last name. Nuggets are disciplined. No one can stop the Joker. Murray's an animal. They're at home. Celtics are not going to be... They, their their energy is not there. Maybe they come out in the first quarter because uh, they're still kind of just like in this fairy tale land of their mindset. 
they're going to get crushed. I have no doubt. I'm going to actually say sprinkle a little bit of money on Denver to win by more than 20 because another difference from Denver to the Celtics is the fact that Denver doesn't lay an egg. They don't just go up 15 and then take a nap. They don't do that. The Celtics, how many times were they up double digits? How is this possible that you can have so much talent and in a matter of a couple of minutes, you let a double digit lead melt? What do the Nuggets do? They pour it on. They rebound. They're a bigger team. Aaron Gordon is, I think he's good. I think he's totally underrated. He's going to be good because all the focus is on Joker. Murray can shoot the lights out. They have supporting cast. They're going to out-rebound. They're going to out-hustle. They play defense. They have a home court advantage. The statistics back it up. I mean, the statistics are crazy. If you want just one of them, I think game one favorites of eight points or more are 21-3. and three. Um, Make that 22-3. and three. I mean, this is, this is the lock of the year. Get your money before the books adjust because the game two spread is going to be 12 and a half. The heat might kind of settle in a little and then we're kind of at like a middle land and we're not really sure which way to go. But for game one in this situation, laying single digits, this is an absolute no brainer. Do not miss this opportunity. Do not forget to be subscribed to my channel. Hit that like button. Leave your opinion in the comments below, regardless if it's extremely um, the other way. Like, I'm totally cool with that. Here on the channel, we can have a discussion about anything. I will gladly accept your opinion, even if you think it is polar opposite to what I'm saying. Let me know in the comments. I'll see you in the next video.